home. And right now I'm heading down to uh, um, not our runoff, but uh, we, a place where we send eight of our heifers to graze. Uh, and we're getting one bull out there and then happening right now uh, where we've sent our heifers off for grazing they're getting the two bulls out from there and they're going to be dropping them all at home so they'll collect this one and then they'll go home and drop off the the three crossbreed bulls that are ours and then they'll take the six uh, white face bulls which are lease bulls they'll take them back to wherever so that's what's happening this morning, I'm just heading down there. I've just milked the cows, haven't done any washing up, just hung the cups up. Well, if you're dealing with 2,000, you know, a lot of bulls, you're going to want a good setup, eh? Yeah. They have a um, massive farm, too. Yeah. Come on, come on. Right, the bulls are gone. Our three are here. Um, we've now got to wash up the cow shed. Um, but those uh, three, uh, sorry, six white face bulls have been awesome. Real good to deal with, real easy handling bulls. Um, I was just talking to the truck driver, and they come from Pukimore. I presume it's like Pukimore Station or it's farm. Um, but yeah, they have done a really good job with their bulls. So yeah, big thumbs up to them. All right, let's get on with washing up. Suck, 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 suck. Come on, come on. Come on, Suki. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on, Suki. Come on. Come on. Oh, we got a straggler way down there. Oh, it's coming. Come on, Tuki. Come on, come on. Come on, Tuki. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, Tuki. Come on, Gil. All right. Good afternoon, everyone. Well, we're back at the hay. Nine days later, I've officially bet Dad's record. So this is the heavier paddock. I'm going to try turning that first, and then I'm going to get onto this paddock here. Um, really, just got to get it off the ground first. See how we go. It is damp underneath. If you if you get down in here, it's definitely very damp underneath. So we're really just going to see how it goes. Um, see whether it's worth bailing. I'm really not sure yet because it's had it had uh, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, 
for Wednesday, Thursday, so five days of rain on it. So yeah, it's not looking good, too good down here. That's pretty horrible. Smells like compost, so yeah, we're just gonna see how we go. Um, we may not even bail it to, or bail it and just, we might have to bail it just so we can get it off the paddock and then decide what we do with it, whether we, whether it's right to feed it or whether we uh, sell it as compost or something like that. So uh, yeah, or we'll put it into a compost pile and then uh, let it rot down and put it back on the paddocks with a spreader. So I'm gonna have a go at turning it now and maybe either turn it again tomorrow or rake it and bale it tomorrow so that's the plan so we'll just see how we go there's still really odd light showers blowing over but they don't seem to be coming too much got a nice bit of wind too so that'll help dry it out so yeah we'll just see how we go all right let's get on with it My opinion is at the moment it looks like crap <laughs> I don't know I really don't know just have to see what it's like tomorrow you can see all the green it's actually not really it's not green grass it's just damp grass so see that there it's still green but it, there's a lot of moisture on it and yeah I don't know. We're just gonna have to see how we go. We're gonna turn it. I wound the front down, the, the top link down a bit more so that it's, the rake's going into the ground a bit more just to try and get it up off the ground because it's really struggling. So, I'll go and talk to this old guy for ease, watching me. Well, I've turned it for the first time and it's actually drying out quite quickly. So, there are a few wet patches. Now this here is definitely a bit wetter, right there. But, if I turn it again tomorrow, it should dry out. And it actually still looks alright. It's just that initial, that, that bit's alright. But, uh, there are a few heavy spots, clumps. That's quite wet. The rake is struggling to pick some of it up off the ground because of, uh, well, it's just it's right down on the ground. That's quite damp, but I'm sure with another turn and a bit of good sunshine and wind tomorrow, it'll be alright. So now I'm going to go and try and do that light paddock and see how we get on. That's it for today. I've had enough of turning hay. I've turned half of it. The lighter paddock, I'm not even sure whether we'll bale half of it. There's not a lot of it left in that lighter piece, or it doesn't seem to be picking a lot up. So, uh, potentially just bale half of that paddock. But, uh, yeah. So, I'll catch you somewhere else on the farm. See ya.